All right, guys, today we're over here at Yuka Sushi. This is the new all-you-can-eat sushi place here in Port Arthur. It's where the old Lubies used to be. Uh, we're gonna check it out. They have some food, they have all-you-can-eat sushi. We're gonna see what it's all about right now. This is Yuka Sushi. We're in Port Arthur in the old Lubies building. Um, we have our all-you-can-eat sushi bar. It's not a buffet. So you sit down at a table, you have a server, it's very personable. We have a full bar, full menu. Um, if you want to do all-you-can-eat, you're more than welcome to, or you can do a la carte and get each individual item. Our all-you-can-eat is one base price, and you can get everything on the menu, as many rounds as you want, however many that you want, and eat until you're full and then leave happy. It's great food, great sushi, great atmosphere. Our employees are awesome. We have great management, great drinks behind the bar. It's definitely worth the wait. Right now we're probably at a two, two and a half hour wait just because we have so many people coming in to try it. But once you get sat at the table and you leave, it's worth it. You're gonna leave happy and it's great. All right, so we're here at All You Can Eat. We got the lunch. There's a lot of good stuff so far. They are missing a few things because this is a soft opening, but I got the black dragon roll, the dream roll, some spicy rolls, spicy tuna, spicy salmon, and then a couple of tempuras. So far, there's gonna be a lot more. All right, somebody got broccoli. I'm not gonna touch that. I'm gonna save my room for real food. We got a black dragon roll. This one has tempura. Looks like it has avocado, some cucumbers, and other stuff. All right, this is the black dragon roll. Let's give this the first taste of sushi here. Let's see how it tastes. That's good stuff. That's really good actually. The avocado, the crunchiness, and sweetness of the mayo, and whatever that brown sauce is, good stuff. I'm impressed so far. We also got some other rolls. We got a spicy tuna roll, spicy salmon roll, and then this roll over here. All right, so here is a spicy tuna. Pretty basic roll, but I love spicy food. I love spicy tuna. It's one that I usually get at any Sushi place. Solid roll. No, nothing like spectacular about it, but that's what that is. It's just like the flavor of the tuna. And the salmon. Basic rolls, but they're good. Let's try this last one. This is, I forget which roll this is. We ordered so many. Basically, oh, we ordered a chicken roll for some reason. Let's try this chicken roll. I usually don't eat chicken rolls, but might as well give it a taste. Maybe it might surprise me. It's a chicken roll. Not my favorite, but there's other food that we got as well. But everything else is good. Chicken roll, not for me, but maybe for somebody else. All right, this is the daydream roll. Y'all eat the shrimp tail? I do. Calcium. So let's eat this one. Try this daydream roll. Mm. It's good with a cream cheese. Sweet. Got some uh, crab on it too. Good stuff. For something like significant. Shrimp tempura. Yeah, you have to eat cane, but you know, you know it's like... Good, hot. It's, it's very friendly, I cook it right? fresh. Got some sushi. This is eel. This is tuna. So let's give this a taste. All right, so this is the eel. If you actually look at the eel, it looks disgusting, but the meat is delicious. Let's see how it tastes. I put a little soy sauce in there. Good, smoky, good eel. Let's try this one. I don't know, I'm just gonna go for the sashimi here. All 
All right, this is a sizzling beef. Let's give this a try. Tuna is all right, nothing special. The eel is much better. Let's try this. With the rice, that would go well. And then this is the beef pad thai. Let's try this. Super hot and fresh. You see it's smoking. I don't know if I call it pad thai, but it's tasty. It's tasty. Getting uh, to the point, we're getting a little bit full now. Uh, still got some more pad thai. Uh, it was all right. I'd probably skip out on that and just eat the sushi, but it's, it's all right. But uh, got some more food, got, some, got three more rolls and some chicken wings. So we'll try that out. All right, these are pretty much a rainbow roll and something else. I forgot a Viking roll, I think. Lots of sushi, lots of rice. Lots of sushi, lots of avocado. Definitely no shortage of avocado in here. All right, so this is their fried chicken wings. Let's give it to you. It looks very crispy. Tastes just like what it is. Fried chicken wing. They have some sauce on it. It'd be good, but just as a, what it is, fried chicken wing, good. I'm full. I am full now. Yeah, still got all the sushi over here to eat. If you don't, you extra, so. If they eat all of it. Let's go. We did it. We cleared all our plates. They aren't going to charge us anymore for our foods. Everybody's done. All right, guys. So that's going to be my time over at Yuka. Definitely a good place for all you can eat sushi. The rolls are where it's at. That's why I like the noodles were good too, but like it wasn't a pad thai. It was more like a lo mein kind of style noodle. That was in like coriander cilantro or like peanuts or whatever so uh, the food was good uh, definitely stick with the rolls for sure you're gonna get full lots of sushi lots of rolls and you're gonna be full for sure all right guys hope you guys enjoyed this video remember to subscribe to me to follow me to the foods see you guys next one peace